Hey guys, welcome back to some more Snooker 19 and part 37 of our Ronnie O'Sullivan career mode. Today we continue the final against the Wizard of Wishaw, John Higgins, in the English Open. He took three of the opening four the frame. uh, frames, three in a row in fact, and uh, it's been a terrible standard so far, to be honest with you. Um, but John has, has grinded his way through them. We missed frame ball pink. In that last frame, John Higgins cleared with uh, a nice break of 35. To win that frame, he now leads by three frames to one. Uh, so thank you for all the uh, lovely uh, support on the series so far. Apologies for being a little bit flat in the last episode. Um, the easiest escape route here. I, f I feel like I was. I don't know why. Um, I just think the, the way the match was going was, was bugging us, really. Uh, but that's a decent that's a really escape from the snooker. But uh, I'm pumped and ready to Shot go today. Success or failure. Um, you know, we need to, to win at least three of these four frames in today's episode to remain in contention, I would say. That's an excellent um, shot. You know, we don't want to be behind. I'm thinking of playing a, a cannon here. Of some sort. This is a bit risky. Looks like he's trying to get the cue ball tight on the cushion here. But we get it. But how's our luck with position? Are you sure, that's not the position he was intending. Uh, we might be able to get through the what? black. Not quite, but long blue. You know, we've knocked in harder. We know pots what a prolific this. long potter he is, so I'd assume he'd take this on. And what a pot that is. Brilliant long pop over distance. So good start. His in this really frame. Well played. Six. But yeah, we don't want to really be behind going into the next session. Usually you're fine in long matches, but this is best Seven. of 17. I know we were 6-2 um, uh, down to Selby and eventually came back to win 9-7. But... That's a good split. You know, I so feel like here. <clears throat> well, feel like we might not be so lucky in this one. A nice pot on this red. Go back up for the blue once again. That's okay. Nicely on the blue. Just about far enough. Thirteen. So once again, thin on the blue. Screw hopefully between that gap. We have done. Little cannon on the red. I'll settle for that. 18. Drop this in. Off the knuckle. Onto the blue. Now if the black passes the green, I might 19. be tempted by it this time. And it does. So... I think screw on and off the Zandy cushion. Sink this into the right corner. Well, an excellent pop. Mm. Didn't quite hit it the way I intended there. Really good. Twenty-six. Got a long red there. Just red into the blind pocket, though. I think is what we want to do. He's attempting to sink this into the left corner pocket. Yeah, nice shot. Tremendous pop. He seems full of confidence at the moment. Twenty-seven. Thirty-four. So we've just got to concentrate now and, and make sure we actually make this contribution pay because in no real problem the opening here. four frames we had a, a couple of good chances to win frames but then just didn't and uh, that's what why we find ourselves three one down you feel whoever hits good form first in this match is gonna run away with it because I don't think the other one is playing well enough really Higgins has missed a few we've missed a few you what know and I think quite easily we could go on and dominate this it this match if we get a frame win and break here Nicely played. That's a pretty good shot, actually. 
Down to the red to the right of the ping spot. 48. Screw back here. A little bit of right hand side. Just to square it up a little bit. Yep. He's got nice position on the blue ball here. 49. This is a very, very good opportunity now. You would have to say. Fifty four. A couple of more reds and colours, and we've done it in one visit after the cannon. Fifty five. That opened this break. It was a bit risky, you know, if we'd missed it, it could have quite easily been John. I don't see any problems here. These. Because <laughs> you know, we pretty much opened up everything 62. with that shot. But a uh, good chance of a sentry here. And quite a large one, actually. 135, I want to say. Or maybe a 137 the key possible. Shot. If this goes in, you fancy him for the frame. Well, that's a frame. Yeah, 137 is available. In this frame. So let's put our all into getting it here. Because that could well be the high break of the competition. 71. That's a nice shot. Mm. Just a little bit pacey. 78. I don't think I don't think we can get through with that, so it will have to be the red into this blind pocket. But it's if it goes in, corner here. you feel certain for the sentry. Oh, and it has just dropped. It has just dropped. 79. Not ideal. 86. Well. This really is tricky. Not quite. Oh, wow. 87. Didn't look like it would go in, but sort of slid in off the jaw. Ninety-four. Some red and black for the sentry. He's going for the left corner pocket. Down it goes. Ninety-five. Fantastic and another sentry in this career mode. Turn up, as John Virgo would say. Absolutely brilliant. I'm just getting the, uh, the spreadsheet up so I can uh, stick in another sentry. But, uh, well, 103. I mean, we've kept good control of the cue ball in this break. Until now. <laughs> 110. Yellow. Screw around the houses. Just the colours remaining on the table now. Oh, well, we missed the yellow. Never mind about that. That break of 100 and... Something. Ronnie O'Sullivan, 110. <laughs> 110. Frame, seated, frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan. And now the frame I'm is happy with that. Thank you, the sixth frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan to break. So, this time, let's see if we can get a decent break. Let's add one to me number of sentries. A little bit narrow once again. Yeah. Annoying. That's our seventh oh, sentry of this tournament, crazily enough. Ooh. That's a poor miss. 20th sentry of the season. So. 
once he left on this red goes so John Higgins with that miss long red it's pretty simple could be leaving the door open for us and I know that we're 3-2 behind but that sentry has really fired us into life here come on keep going keep going perfect eight absolutely perfect a little look at the, the plant as well before we do anything else yep that is a plant so not a bad position to be in here position looks good for a color does the pink go no so we have to go in and out of bulk for that red on the left hand side cushion loose shot or we can play the plant either I'll go <laughs> oh well we've overrun that 14 very slightly just got a little bit excited we need to make sure we don't leave that plant we we'll just play a thin off this one he needs to be mindful of not under hitting this shot that'll do we'll settle for that Great shot. That's a really good safety. So Higgins will spoil the plant here. 14. Safety here, I think. Oh, it, what, well, he's playing it back down here. Um, which might not be the worst shot, really. Mm -hmm. Excellent safety shot. I think we can possibly get this in the end of the green here. He'll want to get this cue ball close to the cushion. Needs to hold up. No. Not good enough. Not good enough, Joe. That was poor. Thin cut here. Well, John Higgins misses again, although he's fluked it. He's fortunate there. One. Unbelievable. To just cling to that top cushion. Six. So there's a couple of loose reds here for John. He really needs to start firing nice now. The colour. Seven. So probably two, three, three well. more loose reds, depending well. on what he does here. Thirteen. Well, no surprises here with the long pot attempt. Don't really know why he took the blue on. Well, it goes 18. in. I guess maybe he's trying to get on this red on the left hand side, is he? The blue is snooping him this time. But he really doesn't want to overhit this. I guess a good idea. I'm just playing the contain and safety now. Does that red go past the pink? Great shot. John Higgins, 18. Ooh, that is close. I'm inclined to say it doesn't. He's looking to get the cue ball safe and tight to the cushion here. I'm inclined to say it doesn't go. Hmm. No, I don't think it does. But I think if we play thin off it, yeah, good cue ball here. I think we can get a very good cue ball here. How about this for a shot? <laughs> He's played that well. very well. He's looking at the easiest way to get out of this. Oh, he's hit them wrong, and he has left a shot. Okay, it's not, not ended well. Tough a shot, guaranteed not pot. What he was hoping for. This looks but relatively easy. It's a pot, nonetheless. Yep. Yeah. Just about One. held it for the black, so this is a good chance already. Nicely onto a red. Eight. Just about. Nine. This should be straightforward enough. 
Really well played. 16. So this to level up, of course. It. Let's break and, uh, well, John will be disappointed that I didn't make more of us being a little bit loose in the first four frames. You know, could have potentially been 4-0 four, four up, but really angled himself, right remember, on the pink and 24. missed it three times. And, uh, and then it potted the Doesn't pink when he was this. trying to get the snook in. So, this match could have quite easily been 4 0, but we got out of the session 3 1, and, you know, at, in, at the end of it, disappointed not to get out of it 3 2. Sorry, um, 2 all, but. Uh, 31. You know, this to level things up, and we're starting to hit full form, which is good. Sentry in that first frame of the episode, getting things going, getting the juices flowing. 32 already in this break. And another potential sentry here, if we can stay on the high colours. It's not the best shot though. That's definitely not the best shot. Might have to play this one up the cushion. Oh no, we're okay. Alright. So let's ride right into the middle. To slot this into the middle pocket. It's a good pot. Tremendous shot. Brimming with confidence and on a bit of a roll at the moment. So not too There's many pots away from securing this sixth frame. Remember, still two more frames to play, so what started out in the episode was yeah, we can't go. 45. Behind, well, we could start thinking about building a lead in this final, but that's not the best shot. We might have it straight up 46. into the corner. Very fortunate, really. I know it's not dead straight, but it's a comfortable pot. Very tricky shot coming up. It's a comfortable oh, what pot. A shot that is. Yes, he'll be very pleased with that shot. What can he do here? 53. So, this is a critical shot here. 49 the lead, 51 on the table. That red secures the frame. Excellent shot. That should be it. No real way for his opponent to win the frame now. 54. We'll have a look at this for a shot. Have a look at this for a shot. Absolutely inch perfect on this red to the left middle. 61. We'll settle for that. So we've got four points of leeway here. He'll want this to drop into the centre pocket. <laughs> oh well. Nicely done. 62. Play a similar shot here. Oh, we've hit the yellow. We need that yellow to pull up a little bit. And it has done. 69. So, I mean, at is least where the yellow is, here? it's a little bit no easier to get on now. Than it usually is. 70. So another sentry could be on the cards here. Should be our eighth sentry of the tournament. 77. Just the colours to go. Mm, might not be on the green here. 79. Oh, well. I'll have to try and bend it. But I don't think we can quite get enough bend on this to, to pot it. To see. Um, I 
Well, you never know. Well, foul, <laughs> but irrelevant. <laughs> Missed it. Never mind. That break of uh, 79 gives us Five. this sixth Brian frame. Sullivan, 79. John Higgins, four. Frame conceded. Frame, Ronnie O'Sullivan. And that is the frame. There you go. Well, even Stevens at the moment with neither player able to gain an advantage. Thank you. So the John Higgins frame. breaking off John in Higgins. this very important seventh frame. John Higgins needs to wrestle back some control in this match. But uh, that isn't going to do it, I'm afraid. Break offs like that. One thing he has got is the black safe. So, to no just come back a couple of inches here. for the pink. Oh, well, wow. starting to play some good stuff now. I think we'll Seven. go back onto its own spot. But what we want to know is does that pink go into the right corner? And the answer is yes. So. Already, this has turned into a decent chance. Pop the pink here. Eight. What red do we get on? Maybe we play a little He's cannon. Sink this into the right corner. What a top pop that was! Oh, wonderful shot! The black shot. does go into the left 14. corner pocket, so we can just run this through a little bit. He's just looking to drop this in gently. Yep. Fifteen. So, just a little bit. Screw back off that red. Oh, where's that red going? That's okay. That very well. Well. Twenty-two. This red next to the black. And all of a sudden, we've opened up this frame beautifully. 23. Now, if we can find the apex of these two reds here, this would open up everything. Just need again into this little gap. Doesn't have to be a hard cannon. But we have to make sure we pop the black. Yeah, that looks about right. This should open everything up. Well, nicely played. That's not too bad. 30. Straight back here. A little bit of left hand side no just to swing it past this red. Yep, that's fine. 31. So, already closing in on 40 point lead. Four reds, four blacks. And we'll win the frame. Or five reds, four blacks. An unforced error. Well, well will it cost that me? is a mistake. Ronnie Sullivan, 38. This won't be easy. John can't get to that red, though. Oh, what a pot that is, though. Where's the cue ball going? It's okay. One. So that missed red. Not an easy one, but a hard Could chance. cost us dearly. We were about to take control of the sure match where uh, this cue ball's ended behind the green, hasn't it? Eight. Oh, that's devastating for John. Looking to play safe here. So just the safety. That's been John's problem. He hasn't had that cue ball under control. I don't even think he's got this safe, has he? Nope. Not what he intended at all. He'll be annoyed He'll with be... that. He will be devastated at that one, John. Go. One. He'll be conscious of not overhitting this. Pace is key. So. That's a really good split, and this is a real opportunity. Well, not perfect. Eight. I can just about get to enough of this red. He's so. looking to pop this into the left corner pocket. 
Oof. Again, it was That's a little bit wide, so he hit it far too well thin, here. and no. hence we were quite on the black as we'd wanted. Just wants Again. to sink this into the left corner pocket. Nope. So a couple of unforced errors in this frame have maybe opened the jaw, door slightly that. ajar for John Higgins. One. I can't see any problems here. The black wasn't the poor shot there. The poor shot was the uh, the, the the red beforehand. Six. Not what he intended at all. Well, That's a poor shot. John Higgins, John Higgins six. will be absolutely disgusted with himself. Challenging pot along the cushion here. Well, we are after that shot. That's One. ridiculous. Right, this pink in the far left corner. The long pot's on, and he's Far right corner, it. sorry. Oh, it's there. By jingle, what a shot that is. <laughs> so, let's have a look at the scores Eight. on the doors. 41 points in front. Still 59 on the table. So colour, red colour. That's a bit sloppy. He's we'll lost be in the lead. Here. But that's 14. just gone a little bit wrong. So He needs to be careful of not overhitting this. It's there. Well, <laughs> we're not, not quite on the colour as we intended. I don't think the green passes. So what's that? 48 points in front with 51 on the table. So this pink is a shot to nothing. The success of this shot is reliant on perfect pace. Oh, right in the heart of the pocket. Brilliant. Just look at that for a positional shot. Superb. 21. It's a good job we did pot it because we'd uh, left John on this red. This looks relatively easy. But, uh, well, we've needed three chances in this frame, but just about managed to 22. take them all. He's yeah, aiming for the left corner here. Quite happy, John has Excellent played point. a few weird shots in this frame. Or, you know, he hasn't had control of the cue ball the way he wanted to. And, uh, you know... 28. Sensing that the mid session interval has definitely had an effect on this match. You know, John's. I mean, I don't think either of us were playing well in the last episode, but John managed to win two of the frames. Three of the frames, sorry. And, uh. Let's see, we've. Now won three in a wow. row. Oh, they're all going in now. 34. Do love a double on this game. Just wants this pot to drop into the pocket. 41. Time for a few adventurous shots. Just the colours so now. Lots of bottom and right hand side. Needed a fizz off the cushion. Didn't quite have enough spin on it as it 40. came back down the table. Not quite. Oh, the black's in. <laughs> Blue. Nah. Well, it doesn't really matter. Uh, we've won that frame and... For the first time since 1 0, we lead this match, and it's four frames to three.
got a one frame advantage now and we'll be looking to build on that lead by taking this next frame and what a huge we frame we've got coming up here now. this next frame should be interesting thank you the eighth frame ronnie o'sullivan to break ah that's much better that is much better crack and break off from us here i think we have left john a possibility but you know you don't fancy him clearing up well, he's playing safe. So that tells its own little story there. Well, hit the brown full in the face. Turns out we haven't got, you know, much to worry about the with a safety of shot. Of his skills. Well, we've underhit it. We've underhit it colossally. So, but we have got away with it. Unless John fancies the thin snake, which he is going for. That is a oh, and he's got a great shot there from John. Little bounce off the cushion. One. Mm. This might be quite tough. And he just took the four points. Five. Might still take he's this on. He has done. That's good. He's oh. not bad at all. Well, he'll settle for that. Well played. 13. In it goes. He's right on top of his game at the moment. <laughs> 14. Twenty. Twenty one. Aiming for the centre pocket here. Beautiful. Wonderful pot. Outstanding effort. Twenty seven. Twenty eight. He's an expert long potter and he's taking this on. Well, this what has been good stuff pot. from John so far. He looks determined to nick this last frame of the session and Level things up going into, He's looking to pop this into the, right corner. the next session. Oh, well, as I say that, he misses a fairly regulation green compared to what he has been playing. But, uh, well, does that red go? I think it does. So he's left us an easy start now. Kiss on the red wasn't intended. One. Might have helped though. Well, maybe it hasn't. Can we bend it? I'm not sure. Maybe a little bit. We can. But how do we get on the colour? That's the question. Mm, this is risky. Hmm. If we pop the blue, screw back for this red into the middle pocket. We'll be okay. Well, I'm not surprised he's taking on the long pot here. It's a good well, pot. We've over screwed it a little bit. But still got that red to the left middle. You see, we were always going to leave ourselves a shot this way. The other way wasn't guaranteed. He's looking at the pot into the left middle. Just no there. It's a little so, bit wide, you feel any harder, and that might not have went. Not ideal. Surely we've gone far enough forward for this one. No, we haven't. This time we'll be bending it. Maybe a little bit less this time. No. You have to hit those perfectly, that's why they're risky. But uh, I think that's we've got away save. with it. Johnny O'Sullivan, 13. 
Hmm. Is there a plant in this right middle? Well, maybe not. It would suggest a possible double here. I do like a double. Most definitely. You'll have to be very careful with the pace here. How about the treble? Not quite. You know, we felt the only red we could leave was the one we were playing. We were always going to be on the black. Oh, what a shot. That's great cubal control. Excellent position. One. This looks pretty simple. He's playing the yellow. That's loose. He wanted more control there. Nice position on shot. So, four. Not an easy one, but a half chance. Oh, what's he playing it? He's played the green. That's just magnificent. He'll be very happy with the position here. Well, he is going to bring reds into play this time. Hmm. He's finished I wouldn't a bit fancy this here. black. Eight. John Higgins doesn't fancy it either, so just the safety. Well, once again. John Higgins, eight. John Higgins not taking a chance. He's playing the safety and aiming to get the cue ball tight against the cushion. So, long red. Or it should come back round and... Oh, tremendous! Oh, 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 oh. Well, <laughs> didn't quite hit it as hard as I wanted to and... Maybe we play the black here. Doesn't guarantee position, but gives us a chance of winning the now, frame can here. can drop this into the right corner? That's a top shot. Well played. That's absolutely perfect, I think. I think we're on that red to the right of the cluster. And we are. And we were on the red under the pink as well. He's so to sink this into the right corner. That's this a would be a pretty big steal because no. John looked very determined to win this frame. And a couple of loose shots from him have led to this. And good shot to nothing from us. 16. Or shot to something it turned out to be. Well, he's playing this into the left middle pocket. That's a great pot. 17. So. Touch a screw back. Got the red into the 24. right middle. Already closing in on him. Red and black takes us into the lead. He's looking at this, this red. Frame. Great shot. Again, a little bit wide, but we're okay. Maybe a bit more power, just to try and guarantee not snookering ourselves. That's exactly what we've done. So yellow, 30. green, brown, and blue for a five-three lead going into just the, the second session. Now. So technically, we could win it in tomorrow's episode. Thirty-four. If we won all four frames, which we have done in this one, so so this pot not beyond the realms. Corner. It's unlikely, but it could happen. Although, having said that, we've played a loose positional shot there. Very loose. So much so. This is now missable. He's playing the pot here. No, not quite. So this is now missable, and we do miss it. So John Higgins is going to cl clean up and level the score in here. The center pocket. We shouldn't have spoke too soon there. Great shot. Four. This looks relatively straight. What a big shot this could. Oh, big miss that could be. Nine. Well, 
Not perfect. This isn't easy. Not perfect. Magnificent pop. He'll be happy with that. Top shot. Fifteen. Nope. Misses the black. So. John Higgins. Could 15. be a bit of respot drama here. Miss me enough. It all depends, depends whether we actually on hit this. Perfect pace. He'll be conscious of not under hitting the cue ball here. Well, we do hit it, but we've messed it up. We didn't want to hit it from behind. He'll be aware of the risks well, associated he's with playing, playing the double. This with too much pace. Oh well, John Higgins, known for how good he is at playing doubles, has missed that one. Does this cut? That's the big question. I don't think it does. But we could play a double. But I think just play a good he old rest up here. Too much pace, or he could leave his opponent on. John might play the double. I don't think just he will. To get the cue ball safe here. No. Just the safety. Mm. Well, it's okay. Just about. So. Problem is, we don't. Hmm. Again, might just play the rest up here. I don't trust myself not to stick them up. So that's what we're doing. As long as this black doesn't bounce too far off the cushion, we're okay. Yep, that's all right. This is a bit better. Now we can actually play the conventional safety shot. Got to hit this right though. He'll be conscious of not overhitting this. Pace is key. We do. Just about. We've got a good length between cue ball and object ball. Pace is very important here. And he doesn't want to underhit this. Where's the cue ball going? It's okay. So... Might actually hit it a little bit thicker this time. Just he needs to be careful of not overhitting Definitely this. don't want to miss it. That's okay. As long as that slows down, which it will. He won't want to underhit this shot. Well, he's put it over the corner. This is a chance. There's a big chance. So, this black to force the respot. Half a chance here. If this black goes in, the scores are level. It's there. And one thing, we've got a respot. So, respotted black. So, a call head required here. We're down to a respot. So, John will play Sullivan, first. Seven. He's playing the cut. He's playing the cut. Oh, well, he's got away with it, though. If we go down, I think this black is tight on the cushion. And it is. Mm, I think that's an impossible shot. Don't think you can cut this black in. But the problem is... Anything other than a perfect contact on this, and we're leaving it. So, what on earth do we do here? I think we have to take some sort of pot on. Don't like it though. Do not like this at all. He'll be trying to get the cue ball safe here. No, that's okay though. That's okay. We knew we probably weren't going to pot it, but equally, position. we were never going to get well, the black there unless the we played cushion first. So, once again, another battle on the black. 
What a huge frame this is going to turn out to be. Brilliantly played. He needs to be wary of underhitting this. Ooh, we've hit that perfectly. Double kiss turret down for John Higgins. Excellent safety shot. <sighs> what a hit. <laughs> his heart would have been in his mouth, though. I mean, it's not far off a double, really. You know, we hit it half ball, but I think that's just too risky. Too risky at this stage. Have to be careful with the pace of this shot. Once again, we hit it decently. It's a little bit off the cushion, though. John might be tempted into the pot here. Yeah, he might be. Oh, well, he's missed it. So, we're going to win the respot. So, just this for the frame. It's there, and what an important frame that could be. We take the final frame of the session on a respotted black. And we now lead by five frames to three. Well, guys, if you've enjoyed that dramatic end to the episode, then make sure you leave a like down below. It really does help me out. It means a lot to me as well. Subscribe to the channel for daily Snooker 19 content, and I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thanks for watching, and goodbye.